Hey guys, welcome back to Genius Tomato. So in this video, we're going to do something very controversial and you probably didn't know about. We're going to cover the five popular Chinese foods that are not made in China and Chinese people will probably never eat. Ever walk inside a Chinese restaurant and notice that most of the patrons are not Chinese people, but instead are people of different backgrounds? That is a good thing, as that means it has to be great food, or at least good enough for people from different cultures to enjoy it. It also means that it might not be very authentic, as there aren't much Chinese people eating inside. Chinese people are very serious about their food, and they want their Chinese food to be as authentic and as close to their grandma's cooking from back home. Many of the times they will not eat food that weren't created in China, and that's a sure way to know how authentic that plate is to the culture. Before we go any further, please make sure to smash the subscribe button and click on the notification bell to get updates on their new videos. All right, let's get to it. Number one, kicking off this list with arguably the most popular and well-known American Chinese food is the General Tso's chicken. General Tso's chicken was named after, well, the real life General Tso. He was a real general and a military hero from the Hunan province in China. I'm willing to bet he never had a chance to taste the sweet chicken that has his namesake. Some say General Tso's chicken was invented in New York City during the 1970s by Chinese chefs in Chinatown. The chefs quickly learned that anything high in sugar content and deep fried will be quite popular here. The broccoli that you will find in this popular takeout dish is not even a vegetable that is grown in China. Don't even expect to find this dish in a restaurant if you're somewhere in China. Number two, orange chicken. In many ways, the orange chicken is a distant cousin of the General Tso's chicken, as it's quite similar. Orange chicken was invented in the United States in the kitchens of the well-known American restaurant chain, Panda Express. It was created in 1987 by Chef Andy Cao on one random day in Hawaii. The original orange chicken was served with bones, but the customers weren't really feeling it. So Chef Cao developed a boneless version of the chicken and thus came along with the American Chinese dish we have today. And it's not made in China. Number three, egg rolls. If you ever eaten from a Chinese takeout restaurant, I am sure you have eaten this deep fried country takeout staple, or at least been offered one as part of their lunch menu special. Egg rolls are closely related to the Hong Kong spring rolls, which is loved by Chinese people. Egg rolls, on the other hand, are like a deep fried mutant version of the spring roll with a rough, bubbly outer skin. It's like a spring roll on drugs. Egg rolls are something you will likely only find on the menu of American Chinese takeout restaurant. The exact origins of egg rolls are still unclear, but it's widely speculated it was created in New York City sometime in the mid 20th century. Chinese restaurants wanted to create something that was sort of Chinese-ish, but would appeal to the American customers with something deep fried. Speaking of egg roll, does it come with my lunch special? Number four, chop suey. Chop suey is another common dish you will find on the Chinese takeout menu, but it doesn't mean it's made in China. It is a dish that consists of different meats, eggs, and cooked quickly with vegetables, such as cabbage, bean sprouts, and the starch thickened sauce. Widely believed to be invented in the United States by Chinese immigrants, there are multiple legends of how chop suey came about. The legend that stands out the most is that it was invented in San Francisco by Chinese restaurants during the gold rush in 1849. A group of hungry miners came in for a meal, but the owner was tired and ready to close up. Instead of cooking dishes from scratch, he scrapped scrapes of food from previous customers' plates and served it to the miners. They loved it, and like that, chop suey was invented. Number five, to end this list with a little Chinese dessert, are fortune cookies. Whoever thought the famous cookies served after a meal in a Chinese restaurant are not from China. The fortune cookie was made popular in California by various immigrant groups in the early 20th century. While the true origins are unclear, there is a wide speculation that the first fortune cookie may have been made in Japan. In the Japanese storybook etching dating back to 1878, it showed a man making something that looked awfully similar to a fortune cookie. The fortune cookie was likely brought over to California by Japanese immigrants who added to their menus for their restaurants. The Chinese might have adopted it and added the lucky numbers to the fortune cookie we all know of today. All this talk of Chinese food is making us hungry. Let us know in the comment section what is your favorite American Chinese food. 
Which one on this list is your favorite? Smash on the subscribe button and click on the notification bell to get updates on their new videos. Until next time, ciao.